thrifting. It's been a while since I've been thrifting with the camera. I have brought a few things, but I have another camera. So we'll go and have a look and see what we can find. And as I got the driveway, I want to show the kangaroos. They're so gorgeous. Okay, see so them at the driveway. I just want to show them. They're huge. There's one that you can see them right, right in there. Look, he's over in the. Oh, he's hard to see. There he is. And there's another one just over there. So let's just go and have a look. I think. Let's see. There, there's the other one around here. Let me just drive around and I'll show you. I just love, they're just gorgeous. Actually, it's a few of them. I'll have to open the window and show you. Hang on, let's have a look. There they are. Hello, little kangaroos. Hello. There they are. Isn't that nice to see? That's not very good because it's raining. They're just beautiful. All right, anyway, let's get thrifting. I've arrived at my destination. Um, I just want to let you know that um, if you can see this mark on my eye, Sam jumped up at me yesterday and scratched my eye and it's so sore. You know, it just breaks the skin a little bit. So if you see that mark on me, it's from Sam. <laughs> I haven't been beaten up or anything. Anyway, we're at the Salvos, I'll show you. There we go, Salvos. I normally go to this one, it's quite a big one. Um, and I normally have um, success in here. So anyway, we'll go and see what we can find. Um, I like that one, but it's ninety five. That one in there. nice to look at the Christmas stuff they give out here. Oh no, oh, they sell them. You never know what treasures they are. Yeah. 
ਦੇ my mum's favourite music from a music box. If you're watching this mum, that's our Lara's thing.
that shop. I was in there for ages because I was haggling with them about um, an item that I got. And then I went away, went to the shops, and then I came back. I thought, yeah, I'm going to get this item. So I'm very, very happy with it. I did a little bit of research on eBay and uh, just to see if it was worth what it was. So I'll show you when I get home. It's really good. So i um, very happy with that. Oh, yeah, I'll show you later. I'm back home from the thrift store. I've got lots of things to show you. I only ended up getting three things today, but I got a few things the other day I really want to show you because I'm very excited about them. So and I'll tell you how much they cost. So for today's list, here is what I got. The stained glass window, that was $8. It's very, very heavy, so it's almost like it's, it's not been, I don't know if it's handmade or not, but anyway, it's very, very tough um, bit of lead. And I just thought it'd be a nice, like, a sun catcher. I got that cushion. This was four dollars. I liked it because it was a vintage colour and it looked like a little bit of a vintage kind of cushion. So I got that because I've got a few things vintage going on, as you know. Best bit I brought today, I'm very excited about, which I told you about before. And the best one of all is this one. Okay, it is. It's not a handbag. <laughs> it cost me. Well, I got it for twenty-five. It was thirty. It's a pair of binoculars. For my little bird watching i know how sad am i but i really really needed some binoculars and there they were and i i looked at them and i thought oh i'm not sure so i went away i went to the shops and when i went back i thought oh, i will get them so they're really really nice so i'll show you what they look like i'll do it quickly because i've got a few things to show you anyway so even the case is nice a little leather case oh, box um yeah they're just that brand i don't know it's not the brand um I don't know. I have to do a bit more research on them. They're very, very heavy and very, very nice. So, yeah, look at those. And the funny thing is, because, you know, I saw the kangaroos on the way out this morning. They were still there this morning, this afternoon. So when I got back, I quickly I looked through them. And it's brilliant because it's like you can see them. It's like they're in 3D. So I'm so happy with those. 10 by, far, 10 by 50 um, field and Bernie contact lens <laughs> coated lenses triple tested that's what it says on there so yeah it's just something I wanted because we live in the country I just wanted that because I I love to see my magpies and you know I can see whatever else is going on and apparently these are really good for bird watching and they're also good for stargazing which is brilliant so very very happy with those all of $25 the other day I got um, these these are really nice now these were three dollars these they are three three heavy heavy duty boxes I'll show a close up what the materials like isn't that lovely again there's a print there again it's like a vintage look they're all stacked on top of each other and I'll show you where they go in my other room in a sec but gee they're lovely three dollars they were um, I got this one yesterday. This was just a dollar. Just a little old pail like that. It'll be nice. I'll probably paint that one up and just rough it up a little bit, but it was alright for a dollar. Then I got this. This is really quite sweet. This one. <laughs> it's a doll's house. It's made like this is um, sandpaper and I think it's like plywood. I'll just show you that inside. How cute is that? <laughs> you can see all inside it. It's lovely, isn't it? It's a detail on that is so good, but it's very, very fragile. Yeah, look at that. This was fifteen dollars, but I don't know if you can see in closer. I'll just turn it around. You can see a little birthday cake in one of the rooms. Isn't that lovely? Anyway, it's on my shelf at the moment. I really don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I just liked it. And the same as these two. There's another two. This one. Someone's done this little project. So this is like this a little um. A little train set as well and then you just take the little look at the window on it and inside is another little scenery I think these would be good for um, you know train enthusiasts you know train hobbyists so in you can see inside there as well inside the door maybe you can't see I'll focus a bit better sorry anyway I think you know when you've got a, a little um, train hobby set and you've got it all set up because it's that sort of size. The house is way too big. And the other one I got was this one. Another one like that as well. And this, what's he doing now? Oh, he's playing with his toys. You take the lid off this one and you take the front bit away and you've got another little scenery as well. How cute is that? 
got a little camper van on the back. So that one and the other one was five dollars, the other one was fifteen. I just got these just for my cabin. It was backgammon, it was just a dollar. Just so they've got some random games down there, if anyone's staying, and just the old Trivial Pursuit just for a dollar as well. That's about it. But I just want to show you where I put those um, the little suitcases because I've done the you know the little mannequins I've got. I've moved them all around now, so they've got different homes now. And I'll just show you what they look. Like. Show you my lovely doll I got. This is the doll I was talking about on my other video. This is the one my daughter got me for my birthday. She's a Parisian doll. Look at that beautiful face on her. Does that focus or not? Anyway, she's really lovely. Yeah, she, her head sort of wobbles forward and a bit like that. It's a bit like a Shirley Temple. And she's got some really old-fashioned shoes on there. It's lovely, isn't it? Yeah, I forgot what the name was, what the name of the doll was, but it's a lovely doll. I'm really happy with that. Okay, so this is what I've done with the boxes. I've just put them next to my little vintage area. And that's my mannequin. Remember the one with the old-fashioned dress? Well, I've taken the dress off and I've just taken, well, I've taken all, <laughs> she's, she's only got that part of her body, the other part's in the other room. Um, I've taken it out of my bedroom and I've just thought it looked really nice on here. Just goes when I look my little corner there. Scored myself a little lounge the other day, so I'm very happy with that nice little lounge. And both of the other mannequins, I might be able to show you from this window. I've got them in, in the greenhouse and I'll zoom in a bit closer and I've put a little vintage dress on this one here so i don't know if you can see that one there and the other so i brought myself another little vintage um little dress to put on this this dummy that didn't really have much on her so she's in the shed as well or greenhouse plus i got this little book the other week i forgot to show you this one as well it's a little vintage book and you know they've got those sort of heads on there as well it's just all about styling of vintage stuff which is really quite nice i just thought it was quite nice for the the uh, to go with my um you know vintage stuff so again that was a dollar um and the other one i i got her a um a little wig so she now has a wig that looks good doesn't it hey covered her um middle bit up so yeah and then i also got these little birds and i found the birds there's a real bird there so i put one of those little birds in there that was another thing i got as well but anyway just before i go i just want to say um thanks for watching my video today and yeah, all my little treasures. I've probably got heaps more, but I don't want to um, find them all now to show you. So these are some of the ones I've picked up recently. And anyway, thanks again for watching my channel, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now. Oh, don't forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Thanks again. Bye.